until that day. The four laps up by the board, Sam Neeson and Ricky Johnson. Ricky Field down the 0-2, playing the new with the 13.
Edmonton. On the point, Jesser Lanouk in second, Arthur Mead third, Sam Music fourth, Matt Lyon fifth, Sam Mateo sixth.
the field. Sixth place is Tyler Hanchick. Another good run up through the field as uh, what a run for Justin LaDuke. As he picks up the win here this evening. Richie Johnson holding on to the second spot. Matt Pion coming back up through the field late for the third. Give it a round of applause, ladies and gentlemen. Justin LeDuc holding off a hard charging. Sam Misek. Over that last restart. second spot with Richie coming home with that position and Payan rounding out the podium and as he finishes his victory lap and set a track side to break. Twenty twenty three was generous to the Leduc Motorsports team and twenty twenty four looks to repeat its predecessor's efforts. The helmet is off, the safety restraints are coming off. First time in 2024 victory lane, it's Justin Ledoux. Justin, congratulations. It's starting to become a little familiar for you, victory lane. This thing was fast. Yeah, thank you, I'm uh, getting the car together. I had a rough season, but it's going pretty good. I had a fun long run, he says, one race, so it was good. It's still early, you know, summertime, knocked it on the door, like we were talking with David Berger earlier, you're getting hot at the right time. What's just going to go into it to keep this consistency? Yeah, consistency is key if you want to get up to it at the right time. You know, there's a lot of work and a lot of people that go in this car that join them. Yeah, and especially when I think my girlfriend Brianna and my dad are coming out. Zach Allen, Gary, and Brett for uh, finishing the car. You know, we're coming out to watch this. Justin LeDuc in victory lane for the first time 2024. Congratulations. Richie Johnson in for a second. You see six or seven of you at one time would just break away from the other 11. You were in there constantly, just couldn't get it over the edge. Yeah, I uh, went to get out front and begin. I was good, but then we had all those cautions, and then we caught back up, and it was just kind of a big old cluster of cars, a little uh, pre-show for the uh, full show next week, and it looked like out there, but I uh, hope everyone's all right, and get their cars back out there uh, in the next race. There's a lot of people you want to thank. Yeah, I gotta thank my girlfriend, my family, my friends, uh, Maddie Tyre, uh, down on the fence, J Corp Unlimited Excavation, Moonlit Roots, Lynch and Combine Insurance, Abstract Welding, Andrew's Family Automotive, It's Alasha's Life, and Cornwell Tools by Alex and Beck and Andy Walker. Richie, congratulations. Another podium finish for the Matic Tire number 18, Matt Clyatt. Speaking of consistent podium finishes, another one. What's been the biggest difference between last year and the year before and the year before as opposed to this year? Uh, we found a lot of problems with the car and we finally got them marked out, so now we, uh, we got the finishes we deserve and uh, we've been running good races and been staying consistent. You started hot, uh, a couple of things happened, but really great run to get back up to the top of the field. What's going through your, your process and your strategy when you fall behind like that? Well, when I was stopped there on top of the track, I thought it was over, but once uh, I put in my dad and Mike Brightman and everybody up there, they gave me a hand to get back out here. I appreciate it, and uh, you know, it's just something to feel as fast as I can. Mike, your dad, who else was up today? Uh, Kevin, Kenzie, I know John was up there helping me change the tire, and just uh, everybody's going to be a helping hand throughout the years. Uh, outdoor Living, Barracks Towing, Warren Tire, DG Custom Graphics, and everybody's helping out. Matt Plyon in for third once again. Richie Johnson taking home second and in victory lane for the first time in 2024. It's Justin LeDuc.